it's time. You all have been asking for it. What is it you say? Well, <laughs> let me show you. I have been cooking up a heinous, evil, uh, despicable, uh, hopefully fun way to play through Castlevania Symphony of the Night. <laughs> if you're watching live, this will be a, a little bit of a surprise for you. Uh, live over on the live stream, twitch.tv slash dragonblitz. Join the stream. I'd love to see you in the chat sometime. You might be uh, concerned because you can see the damage I'm doing to Dracula. <laughs> and you can see the damage stacks uh, are not happening. Damn, how much health? We could actually do the math to see how much health Dracula has with that. That's pretty interesting. Yeah, damage numbers, pretty cool, pretty cool. If you are watching on YouTube uh, over on Dragon Blitz Daily, first of all, what's up? Don't forget to subscribe. I would appreciate it. Second of all, uh, like I said, join the live streams. You could also, you know, like the video. Ring the bell. I, I hear ringing the bell does something. Have you ever tried ringing a bell before on YouTube? Tell me what it does. I've, ne I, I've never done it before. All right. We're approaching the point where you guys are going to be figuring out what's going on. I'm going to be unequipping all of my gear. However, down here... Oh, why is that God's Guard? What the fuck? Hold. <clears throat> down here is a secret little uh, item that I will be equipping. And this will be the only item I will use for the entirety of the run. What? That's right. It is the Axe Lord Armor run you guys have all been waiting for. I know, I know. Look how fast he's going. Wow. Oh, God. <laughs> uh, imagine this was a no-hit run and I just reset right there. That'd be very funny. Axe Armor is OP. I know. Fun fact. Some weapons with Axe Armor don't work. Shuriken, nice. Now you might be wondering, wait, but you can't jump up ledges. How are you gonna finish this run? Well, there's a secret technology called unequipping the Axe Lord armor and re-equipping the Axe Lord armor. Whoa, wait a minute. Hold, you're telling me every time you need to make a jump, you gotta take off the Axe Lord armor? That's crazy. <laughs> I can't, come on, seriously. <laughs> it's so bad. It's so bad. All right. Uh, don't worry about death. Death, uh, he's not important. I asked him very nicely to leave me alone. All right. There are enemies coming up. I have to put on the Axe Lord armor. Oh, but now I got to make a jump. Hold on. Let me take off the Axe Lord armor. Oh, there's an enemy right here. Hold on. Let me jump up to him. Put on the Axe Lord armor. Oh, we got the item. All right, cool. Now we have to take off the Axe Lord. Isn't this what you guys wanted? Poggers. Oh, my God. All right, let's go ahead and go uh, fight the first. Uh, I mean, go to the first area. Wait, what's happening? What? Double surprise. Turns out it was a boss rush the whole time. So we are doing the Axe Armor Boss Rush Challenge, a.k.a. mash the attack button as fast as you can. Huh? Oh, it's up here. What? Hoggers! Uh, you guys want to see something funny about Axe Lord armor? Here, I'll show you. So if you walk into the fight with Doppelganger, pause the game, and then equip Axe Lord armor, you can just walk around. You're supposed to be, like, frozen during this little cutscene, but you can just walk around and do whatever you want. In fact... You can even hit him early. Oh. Leave me alone. Okay, come on. There we go. I showed him. <laughs> Ow, that's actually a lot of damage. Hold on. I haven't really thought through how I'm going to fight these bosses. 
I just assumed that it would be easy. But maybe it won't. Like, I can't hit this guy, really, when he's flying around. Oh, wait! Just kidding, you can do, like, a barely, like, jump slash him. Nice. All right, let me actually grab life max ups, because as uh, has already been pointed out, shaft might be impossible. <laughs> That's the thing about these dumb challenges. Every time I'm like, oh, let me do a dumb, you know, boss fight challenge or whatever, uh, I always forget that shaft is a boss that you have to fight in this game. Everyone's like, oh, Gallimoth, blah, blah, blah. Gallimoth will be easy, all right? Because Gallimoth, you could at least dodge, theoretically. Wait, really? I'm bad at the game? I let myself get hit by Karasamon twice? All right, whatever. Beezlebub will be easy. Maybe. Actually, I haven't really thought about Beezlebub. Because you're not able to... Wait, you can equip the Axe Sword armor in the air? Hold on. Can you attack... But you can't attack in the air? Hmm. I don't know. We'll figure out something. I mean, if everything's just going to do one damage to me, I'm not worried about it. Oh, perfect. Thank you for damage boosting me up here, making this fight even easier. Get owned. Hell yeah. All right, can I even make it up there? Ugh. Hold on. I'm going to try my best. Ugh. Come on. No, come on. Ugh. Come on, man. I need the life max up. Give it to me. Nope. Nope. Sorry. Oops. Nope. Sorry. Oops. <laughs> nope. Good. Nope. Sorry. Mm. How do you access the Joels? Uh, type exclamation mark Joel. And then pick whichever one's your favorite. All right, we're moving on. <sighs> Whatever. Streamer spends three hours trying to get a life max up. Unironically, I would. Yeah, I don't think that. I don't think it's possible. I don't think that one's possible. One thing I am curious about, oops. That's it. Ow, that's actually a lot of damage. Ow, why are, why is this guy doing like so much more damage than like every other boss up to this point? That's crazy. Uh, I'm wondering if we get, because it's been such a long time, I forget. If you get the axe sub-weapon, can the axe armor throw axes or no? I genuinely can't remember. I have, a f I have a feeling that maybe the axe armor can't throw axes. Let's find out. The axe armor cannot throw axes. This is the only attack you get access to in axe armor. You bet your ass I'm going to feel Richter's Unbridled Wrath. Can it throw armor? Now we're asking the real questions, actually. Ooh, ow. Okay, the damage is ramping up. I can't dodge that attack. I just have to hope he doesn't do it. Another issue with axe armor runs is, um, like, what was I supposed to do to dodge that attack? Like, I can't crouch. I can't jump. Can I buff my stats with other items? I might have to for the later bosses, but we'll see. Hey, I'm a nip. That, that's not how this works.
do a spell. Ooh, buddy, oh boy. Yep. Let me let me tell you about all the spells Alucard uh, has access to. While in axe armor form, the answer might surprise you. Unequip and then duck. Dude, I don't want to have to open the menu to start dodging uh, attacks, but I might have to. All right. I'm going to start putting on other defensive stuff just to make my life a little bit easier. Because, like, come on. What? Can you do the, the suck me dry attack? I think if I'm like far enough away, you'll go for it. Oh wait, I guard it? It's not ice, right? No, the axe armor is immune to curse. I guess? Because that's a cursed attack, is it not? Oh, fuck. Speaking of cursed attacks. Okay. Can you grab me? Can you suck me dry, ma'am? Ma'am, I'm asking you politely, please suck me dry. How is that not hitting you? The axe is up in the suck you bussy. I can't believe this shit. Ma'am, please? I showed you my axe armor, please? Please? I swear, she has an attack where she's supposed to suck me dry, I swear. Does she not go for it if you're in axe armor mode? Tribute. There it is. Make them your slaves. Close. Uh, Vivi, thank you very much for the sup. Can't get sucked while you're wearing armor? You say so. Speaking of menuing. What? The dodge attacks. <laughs> this is so stupid. No. Dude! Oh, it's so Jover. It's so Jover. This is actually... Because I can't get close enough. What? Oh, he's going to jump? Oh, okay, we got him. We got him. Close one, close one. I have to get hit by the fireballs fair and square. Yeah, you're right. No, dodging the attack is cheating. You have to stay in the the, the trance in the the axe armor form the whole time and just let yourself get hit, or else you're cheating. You know, I know we were talking about Shaft and Beezlebub being issues, but what about Grand Falloon? How the hell am I going to hit Grand Falloon? I mean, this guy is like, you know, whatever. He's going to stand there and let me ask him a question. Oh, shit. Everyone forgets about... Grand Falloon, you asked the question? Well, maybe uh, you should have asked it a little bit louder. I was intentionally getting hit by his toes because it does less damage. The toe manip. You guys don't know about the, the foot damage boost? Oh, never mind. He's doing one damage no matter what. I lied. This is the quality content you guys wanted, right? This is the axe armor content everybody's been hoping for. 
The, the issue with doing falling axe armor attacks is I don't think you can. Like, I'm at the top of the screen. I'm going to mash the attack button as fast as I can. I'm like halfway down by the time the axe attack comes out. That might be enough to hit the core. Maybe. We're going to find out. Is this an item? No, it's not. Okay. We'll find out right now, actually. If it's possible. What? The Apex of gameplay? No, you're thinking of Apex. Legends. I can at the very least hit this part. Reliably. Oh, no. Oh, no. The bodies. Mr. President, the bodies have hit the floor. Oh, God. Mr. President! Get down! They're everywhere! All right. Here's where we find out if Axe Armor can even do any... Maybe not. We're, we're trapped in the fucking mosh pit right now. Oh, my God. Dude, I am in the mosh pit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. At the fucking mosh pit... At the drowning pool concert. The bodies have hit the floor. Oh god, and there's lasers! This might be an issue. You think? Okay. I'm gonna try my best here. Do the bodies give the EXP? No. Oh, baby, one hit. All right, hold up. We just have to do that over and over again. Wait. Oops. What? Oh no! <laughs> no, a human being with the tier three. <laughs> right now? This is the moment you're like, I, I need to see more. I need to reward this, this person for their gameplay. This is the gameplay you thought was worthy of a tier three subscription. Go to the core. Oh, go to the, go to the core. Oh, of, duh. Well, I thought I was just supposed to get hit around for 10 hours. Oh my God, you're so smart. Hold up, that changes everything. Holy shit. What was I thinking? Just use spells. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Fuck me. What? All right, we got another one. We got another hidden. Any second now. I'm not giving up on this. I'm not a quitter. I'm not a quitter. What? Oh, baby, look at that damage. Hold up. You need to hit the boss? <laughs> Wait a minute. I, the whole time I thought... What? No, I'm doing, I'm doing some solid damage. You seeing this shit right now? Uh, hold on, let me just... I think I might be able to get away with doing that. What? Fuck. Hopefully I don't get hit. Does this cancel my vertical? Oh, it does. Okay. So if you try and do a gravity jump, I'm learning a lot right now. If you do a gravity jump and then put on the axe armor during the gravity jump, it cancels your vertical momentum. Hmm. <laughs> no worries, j -Dub. Hope you're having a good one. Please cheat on this boss. No, think of the YouTube comments. They'll be so upset at me for cheating. No, we have to play legit. This is the axe armor fight you guys have all wanted. 
Why doesn't streamer do axe armor speedrun? Hmm. When are when's the axe armor uh, no hit challenge? <laughs> I don't know. I did an axe armor playthrough when I was uh, four years old in my grandma's basement, and I did it with no hits, and it was also world record. I can't let the YouTube comments get away with that. I can't get roasted by YouTube commenters, the most smart and beautiful and handsome people on the planet. If you do a spell, hypothetically, let's find out. If you do a spell and then put on the axe armor, does it delete the spell? It doesn't. All right, hold on. Well, theoretically, I'm still wearing the axe armor when the damage is happening. So, hypothetically speaking, Theoretically, uh... No, uh, I was wearing the axe armor when that happened. Shh. Don't let the YouTube commenters know. No, 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 no. It's, 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 it's real. It's, it's, it's... No, 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 This is legal, 100%. 100% legal. Do I still have the invincibility? I do not. It doesn't help that that guy is like really high up. It's just like a thing that happens. What? Axe armor can use spells? Well, not anymore. I'm out of magic. All right. Now here's the real question. What if I? What? Throw an axe! Ha ha ha! <laughs> it's working! Hold on. The axe armor can throw axes! You just have to throw the axe first and then put on the axe armor. <laughs> Menu simulator? Have you guys ever wondered maybe why I haven't done this challenge before? What? <laughs> this is so fucking stupid. Uh, does Dark Metamorphosis stay with the axe armor? That's actually a good question that I will uh, look at in a second here. I kind of just need my, to wait for my magic to come back, to be honest. Come on. Big damage, big damage. There it is, let's go. Wow, Axe Armor only defeating Grand Falloon <laughs> for the first time ever. I'm pretty sure I'm the first person to ever do that. I would hope I'm the first person. I hope nobody else has ever tried to do that. That's so stupid, if if so. If you have ever tried to do this at home, let me know. And um, also, I've been waiting for you. Oh fuck, I forgot about this guy. But why is a Belmont planning the resurrection Shit. of Dracula? Am I refilling my MP during this cutscene? Wait, why isn't my MP refilling during this cutscene? Other cutscenes in the game actually refill your MP while the cutscene's going on, in case you guys didn't know. But this game, for whatever, this one, no? Uh, I might be in trouble, I'm not gonna lie. Why? I think I'm dead. Phase two will make me cry. Uh, I'm gonna use my elixir here because I don't want to restart. I do have some mana prisms. All right, let's uh, let's do this. You can't hurt me with axes. I am the Axe Lord Master. Okay. Magnificent. But now feel my unbridled wrath. I need to, real quick, I need to take this shit off. Wait, did he, he just canceled out of his axe attack? He can do that? What? 
I have never in my life seen that. What the fuck? What? He's just fucking cheating now, and he's invincible! No, don't hit me with the chop! Dude, fuck you. God, I'm dying to this fucking guy. Do I have any more healing? I got fucking spaghetti! Oh, I got a good spaghetti. That's all I got is spaghetti and ice cream. I don't think we can do it. Oh, no. Unless... Because I think he does this attack if I use spells. Yeah, and he doesn't even have a hitbox, dude. Soul steal doesn't work. How am I gonna soul steal? Wait, it does work. No, it cancels the soul steal. It's over. It's not over. What? I'm just too good at the game, actually. Uh, have you ever considered that maybe I'm just built different? My swag too tough. My axe armor too different. I mean, I'm out of healing, but... What? Anyways. Axe armor, go! Ow! Axe armor, go! Ow! Hold up, I'm actually getting fucking owned. Like, this is the easiest boss in the second castle, and I'm getting fucked up. He hasn't even done the, the, the actual fucked up attack. The wind one. Yeah, this one. Like, there's nothing I can do about it. There we go. I have found the secret tech to all bosses, jumping. Yeah, it turns out when you're not able to reasonably jump, the game is uh, kind of fucked up. He can't wind toss you? Yeah, but... Oh, Karma Coin, hold up. Unironically, that Karma Coin might save our asses. Empty hand, all right. If we get heads on the Karma Coin, we can heal ourselves. Unironically, that might be required. Oh, uh, who's next? I don't remember. Oh, God. Oh! Okay, easy. Easy fight. He just wants a hug. Ugh. Uh, why don't you dodge the attacks? You know what? I'm do I'm dodging them now. See how many attacks I'm dodging right now? How about that, huh? Easy. Creature might be a pain. I think I have an idea for creature. That shouldn't be too bad, hopefully. I'm hoping at least. All right, let's get out of here. I don't think Shaft is going to be possible now. I'm very confident that Shaft will not be possible. I think I'm immune to being stoned in this form, so I think I'll, yeah. Oh, it still hits me though, which is annoying. All right, cool. You know what, this is actually, yeah. Okay, this is fair. Yeah, fair. Yep. Good trade, good trade. Good trade, good trade. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, the double hit. Hold up. Easy money. All right. Axe men can't jump. You know, 
Ugh. I hate to play into stereotypes and all, but it it's true. Axemen can't jump. Talisman might actually be busted. We'll see. Does Talisman even work? I mean, I'll have to lower my defense or my luck, but if I have higher luck, I'll have a higher chance of the Talisman proccing. Oh, man. How dare you make me make decisions? I can use the luck potion to try and increase my luck stat. Hmm. To stay alive. We'll see. There we go. All right. Yeah, creature easy peasy. Clip the end of the Richter fight. Hell yeah. If you guys end up making any clips, by the way, uh, I would appreciate it because, oh, fuck this guy. Because I want to start turning stream clips into YouTube shorts just because, like, it's pretty easy to do and it might help the YouTube stuff. Um, and if you end up making a clip, uh, you could always post it to the Discord as well. That helps me make sure I see it. Um, but yeah, regardless, I appreciate it. Feel free to clip the stream whenever you want and post them wherever you want. Clipping the stream helps the stream a lot. Yeah, every time I cheat, uh, post a clip. Clip my ass. I, I, I genuinely appreciate it. All right. I don't know if this boss fight's going to be very uh, possible. Uh, okay. Here's what we got to do. We got to get the death balls. All the way in this corner. Then I need to leave. I would help, but I don't know how to do it. Uh, there's just a button on the stream that clips the stream when something happens. So if something funny or interesting happens on stream, you just press the clip button, and then it'll let you make the clip. Okay. Well, I'm starting to think that maybe this idea was uh, dumb. This is the moment I think the axe armor only was a bad idea. Nope. Uh, I, I paused in time. I paused in time. Nope, that was axe armor damage, I swear. The, the, the stupid randomly spawning scythes are tanking the spirits. Oh, God. I hate this. I'm not cheating! Oh, fuck. Okay, I might be cheating a little bit. This cancels it, right? What? It just fucking cancels the Souls deal! Oh. I mean, I knew it would, but, like, I just wanted to believe. All right. Chat, it's time. It's time. Oh, God. Uh, fuck, it's time. Heads or tails, what's it gonna be? I need heads. I need heads so, I need heads so bad. This music's a little loud. Chat, I need heads so bad. If I don't get head right now, I probably die. It's gonna be a quick one, one minute. You got one minute on the clock. 
Let's see it. One minute on the clock. Do I get head? Yes or no? Also, this is a uh, messed up. Hold up. There we go. Do we get head? Yes or no? I need to know. Gamble now. All of your points matter. Clearly, if you gamble heads, it means heads is more likely, right? You guys, 75% of you can't just be wrong, right? Okay, how come every time we do a coin flip in this goddamn stream, it's like 70% on like heads or 70% on tails? The one time I want it to be heads, you guys actually get it to 50-50? What the fuck? All right, it's it's time. Let me fix the uh, timer. All righty, it's time. What's it gonna be? Come on, heads! Come on, heads! Come on, heads! It was heads! Yes! I'm alive! Yes! Easy money. Your boy gets head. It's just that simple. Start gambling. Gambling is a uh, an investment. You will win. You will you simply will just win. Now, the question is, um, I still don't think I can beat him. I I don't, because we're still, like, you know? I guess my next question is... Oh, nice talisman. Will I be able to... Do that? Does that count? I mean, the damage number showed up after I put the axe armor on, so surely that's legal. Dude, I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die in real life. I'm gonna die in real life. I'm gonna die in real life. Oh my god. Yes. Yes! Hold up! This is it! This is it! I can out DPS him. 100%. Phase 2 is, a, is easy, as long as he doesn't throw the scythe. Nice! Okay. We only had to do a little bit of cheating. A tiny amount of cheating. A, honestly, not so much cheating that it actually mattered, but you know, just a little... Like, the perfect amount of cheating, if you ask me. What? And we got the coin flip, so that's what really matters. I think he's very confused by the axe armor. Doppelganger 40 seems to not really understand how the axe armor works. Oh, shit. Wait, I'm immune? Oh, fuck. Oh, I jumped over it! Holy shit, I used the tiny-ass jump to jump over the fucking wing smash! Whoa. Okay, I couldn't do it a second time. Whoa. Doesn't matter. I'm better. I'm just better. I'm just better. Fucking get good scrub. GG's. I'm simply better. What? Built different, swag too tough, axe armor too hard. Oh. 
Barrel circlet. Does the barrel circlet affect the Axor armor? Probably, right? I guess we're going to find out. Oh, aren't we doing trio first? Oh. We are doing trio first, aren't we? Maybe the opal circlet will come in clutch. We got lucky and started with the opal circlet, so... Dude, another fucking Belmont. Fuck you, Ralph. Okay, I'm actually insane. I'm simply built different. <laughs> I'm healing from the, the ice attack, and Ralph gets fucking infinite comboed. Fuck you, Ralph. Get your ass down here. Grant, get your ass down here and die. The juggles, the combo. C -c 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 combo. Wait, actually, as long as you have the opal circlet, this fight's not that bad. Actually, opal circlet with axe armor, that was really doable. <gasps> okay, meal ticket. Hold up. Oh, I need to... I can't use the meal ticket unless... Oh, sirloin, that's huge. Eh, apple, okay. Whatever. What? Yeah, we, we definitely ultra comboed. Oh, fuck. Like... Can I even hit him? What? I mean, I can hit his feet. Which actually doesn't do damage to him, fun fact. His health pool is based off of hitting his face. At least I think that's how it works. All this is going to do is spawn more flies. I think this is genuinely, if not impossible, the dumbest thing I've ever attempted in a video game. So for that reason, I have an idea. I'll try this a couple of times. And by a couple of times, I mean literally once. All right. Let's just say for the sake of, uh, of argument that spells were... So far, we've all been okay with spells, right? Now let's just take that like one step further, right? Let's assume that spells are okay. Well... If I take a look at the spell menu, right here I'm seeing Wing Smash as a viable spell. Um, so simply, uh, you know, it, it's, you know, it just, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> I don't want to figure out how to fucking deal with this guy, I'm going to be honest. Like, I genuinely think it would be, like, Grand Falloon, but a hundred times worse. So we're just going to move on. The wiki says Axe Lord can use Wing Smash. True! Uh, oops. We got the Barrel Circlet. It'll be fine. I feel betrayed. You know what? If you are upset, you can go to... Um... You can type exclamation mark scam in chat. Watch the informational video. I actually need you to do the thunder spell again, please. Thank you. This is fine. I don't care about this. In fact, actually, I'm turning the talisman off and I'm going luck for crits. I need higher crit damage. 
By the way, this is what any time anyone ever is like, why don't you fight Galamoth legit? This is what fighting Galamoth legit is like. You just walk away and wait for him to do an attack that you can do damage to him with. It's it's you just walk away, hope he does an attack that you can dodge. If you have barrel circle, you can use it versus this attack, which is nice. If you don't have barrel circlet, you just have to wait this attack out. This attack, you cannot absorb with barrel circlet. It does not do lightning damage. Fun fact. A lot of people don't know that. They just assume that all of his attacks are lightning damage. They're not. It's just this one and the other lightning horizontal wave that he does. And what happens when he does this attack over and over and over again? You just wait. I mean, here we're just waiting on crits and that's it. No crits. Oh, there's a crit. There we go. Oh, he walked forward this time? Damn, what a mix-up. It says rip on the floor. Yep. If I remember correctly, I'm pretty sure Boss Rush nerfed Galamoth's base health a little bit. Does MP not refill when you're in Axe Armor? I guess it doesn't. Huh, I've never noticed that. Yeah, my MP is not going up. I guess Axe Armor just can't refill MP. That explains why my MP wasn't refilling during the cutscene. Yeah, I thought the cutscene was, like, messed up. Oh shit, damn it! Sorry for the axe armor idea, it's fine. For some reason, I think this is pretty normal amongst, like, all challenge run slash speedrun communities. I got a critical hit and it did one damage! I'm sorry, I didn't even know that was possible! Anyways, I think it's very common amongst speedrunning or challenge running communities for people to have an idea of what an actual challenge is, and then the speedrunner be like, no. Like, that's it's a, it's a bad idea, but then people keep asking because the person won't do it because it's a bad idea, and then eventually they do it. And it's like, whoa, this was a bad idea? Who could have foreseen such a thing? I can't... Oh, you're telling me that this game was designed wasn't designed for axe armor i can't believe it i've been scammed i want my money back i can't believe we've all been bamboozled by igarashi and big uh konami but it's fine i mean we're having fun that's what matters at the end of the day it's not a bad idea if we're having fun what are you talking about? This is peak? Yeah, fair. No, this is peak, yeah. This is what Symphony of the Night was all about. This is actually what Symphony of the Night is all about. Also, when people tell me that, like, oh my god, Galmoth is, like, a really hard boss or whatever, he's the super mega turbo evil boss, it's like, if I wasn't using Axe Armor right now, it wouldn't be that much harder, right? Or easier, I mean. Even if I wasn't using Barrel Circle, it wouldn't be that much harder. I would just have to use the Mist transformation to dodge this lightning attack. Or I would hang out on the, the top part. Like, this boss fight is kind of a gimmick. It just He just does a lot of damage and has a lot of health. He is the epitome of what I think a lot of fledgling gamers think difficulty really is, which is high damage numbers. 
He has 10 billion health points and he does 10 billion damage. Therefore, he must be difficult. Oh, we got a two uh, critical hit. Nice. But when you he has two attacks that are very easily dodged. I don't know. Shaft, I don't think will be possible. Straight up. Tedium equals difficulty. Yeah. I think it also does stem from, like, this game is an RPG as well. It's an action RPG, but it is an RPG. So big numbers is kind of like how a lot of RPGs just kind of balance things, I feel like. So, like, Super Boss having 10 billion HP is just kind of, like, you know, expected. How long do you guys think this is actually going to take? Uh, do we have any mods that want to do a prediction if I finish in the next five minutes or not? Do I finish before 57 minutes? Sure, let's do let's do a gamba. Do I fin ish? I'm trying to do two things at once. The four fifty seven minute. Yes. No. Uh you got one minute to decide. Go fast. Gamble fast. Okay. I was doing all that with one hand while mashing with the other. All right, so the spelling mistake in there is uh, my bad, I guess. Also, am I? have I found the infinite? Is he no longer doing the other attack? Did I find the perfect spacing? I think we actually have him in the infinite. Yes, yes. Okay, we have the infinite unlock, okay. Yo, is that our boy, Axar? Oh, those crits were going crazy. Everyone, you gotta vote yes. Clearly I'm gonna finish before 57 minutes. Did you see those critical hits? Oh, another big critical hit. Critical hit, 52 damage. Massive critical hit. Unironically, this is very funny. Oh no, the infinite's over! Just in time for the gamble to end, for everyone to get scammed. Watch, he's gonna do that move 12 million times now. All right, never mind. Because we're at the mercy of him and his RNG, really. You guys, um, see any cool movies lately? What do you get as produced from evil chickens, deviled eggs? Oh. Streamer claims he he's world record holder yet takes more than 57 minutes to beat Boss Rush. True. You watched the Mechanist? Machinist? All right. Uh, lazy joke, that's a one minute timeout. Sorry. If you're gonna make a joke that's like tangentially raci racist, at least make it funny. Please. Or at the very least, just not like the laziest thing I've ever heard. Cause you didn't have to chat in this in this chat room. You didn't have to. Nobody forced you to type that. Anyways. 50 critical hit. Let's oh baby, big crits. Okay, I can't dodge the, the shaft swing here. I can't move fast enough. Don't worry, guys. I'm trying to do as much damage as I can. 
I'm trying to speed this up as much as I can. RNG, save me. Come on. Come on. Okay, two minutes. We still got two minutes, chat. We still got two minutes. You just got to believe. Okay, well... No, hit him in the toes. Stop clipping his toenails. I think you need to try again without barrel circling. I think you need to go to hell. <laughs> no. We've already been doing this for like 20 minutes. There we go. And it turns out, yes, we do finish in under 57 minutes. Honestly, it was kind of close. Congratulations, you've won. Uh, Hoggers, let's go to the shop. I'm interested in. <laughs> is there anything worth buying? Let's find out. Because all that's left is Shaft and Dragon. Fairy card? Wait a minute. Please tell me Life Apple. Damn it, no Life Apple. Okay. There is, however, more Karma Coins. There are potions. We might do a Fairy card potion strat. I have one life apple, but I was hoping to buy more. Because we're going to die, most likely. Versus Dracula and Shaft. Is there anything else we can do to increase our damage? Dragon Helm? That's pretty good. Ring of Fenor is also pretty good. Okay, hold on. I need to do some math. This this actually matters. I think the double Fanor is probably the play, and then potions plus fairy. What can I do for you? I'm interested in this. So we're definitely getting the fairy card because it's free. We're definitely getting Dragon Helm. Thank you. I think we're getting double Fanor. And I think the rest just goes to potions straight up. I don't think there's really much point in buying anything else. And hope that the fairy just keeps us alive with these potions. Okay, one karma coin for the Gamba, because you guys are addicted. Just one, and then the rest on potions. Yeah, I think it's the play. Uh, Dragon Helm lowers by a set amount, I believe. I think it lowers it by four. All right, let's try and finish this off strong. 73 potions. Surely that's enough. Double Fenor. Uh, I might keep the barrel circlet on for the lightning attacks, but we'll see. All right, it's go time. Oh shit. Uh, we're stuck. <laughs> Welp, GG's everybody, we can't. All right, real quick, last coin flip. We got our karma coin. Runs over. Get your coin flips in now. What's it gonna be? Heads or tails? Who will win? It's either one or the other. There's no secret third option. Got to get your points in now. Now... Conventional wisdom would tell you that a coin flip has the odds of either being heads or tails in a 50-50 uh, uh, type uh, manner. But this chat room would lead you to believe that it actually is a 70-30 <laughs> in favor of tails. 
because if you think about it, right, it has to be 50-50. Last time we got heads, which means if it truly was a 50-50, this time it has to be tails, right? I'm on the wrong side. So let's find out. Get him, coin flip. It was heads again. Oh, the misery. I can't believe such a thing. Womp, womp, womp. Wait, who put all that money in? Let's find out. 150k by goths are better than emos. Welp, in this one scenario, the emos win. I hate to break it to you. You know, you'll get them next time, I, I swear. I swears it to you. Oh, buddy, oh boy. That's that's rough. That's rough. Big payout to the heads, uh, head enjoyers. Any head enjoyers in the chat? What? All right, let's get them. Oh, 69, big critical hit. All right, well. No, get down here. On the bright side, I do get to heal from this attack. Proud head enjoyer. Get down here! Oh my. This guy thinks he's so cool. Ooh, sick dodge. I'm simply better. Look at the spacing. Oh, oh, okay. I, c I couldn't dodge that one. Okay, finally, I can do damage during this attack. Easy money. All right, actually, Shaft was easy. <laughs> Turns out Barrel Circlet is really good. I didn't even need that. I thought the potions were going to be necessary, straight up. This guy thinks he's so cool. Yeah, circle it, save the run. To be fair, you always get barrel circle it in the uh, boss rush randomizer, so. It was destined. <laughs> this is so silly. I mean, I can't really dodge that. Big damage, big damage. Uh, I also should have the Dragon Helm on now for extra damage. All right. The damage boost to avoid the bigger damage. Big brain. Damn. All right. I think we're going to be okay. Wow, that's actually a lot more damage than I thought it would be. Oh my god, I almost dodged it. There we go. All right, well. 
There it is. Ah, uh, okay. We didn't even need that potion, but we only used one potion. GG's, and without any cheating whatsoever, asterisk, we did <laughs> uh, an entire playthrough only taking 147 hits, only 2,000 damage taken, but totally legit axe armor only boss rush, and it took us over an hour. <laughs> uh, you know what? And you were here, that's right. And you watched it either live over on the Twitch channel, twitch.tv slash DragonBlitz, uh, join the live stream, or you watched it on YouTube, DragonBlitz Daily Viewer. Thank you for watching, subscribe, all that fun stuff. Ring the bell and join the live stream. See you later. <laughs>